because Anna, as we said at the start of the show, uh, the initiative is very much sort of wrapping up now, isn't it? It's coming to a close uh, for the end of March and you've organised a very special series of events to celebrate this, haven't you? We have. So our closing ceremony is a series of events and attractions um, inspired by the 200 year anniversary of the Chicken Rock and the Point of Air and the uh, Carpet Man Lighthouses. So we'll introduce the first event on the 7th, 8th of March. I'm so sorry. Friday, the 8th of March. uh, We've got a dinner and talk at the Sound with Charles Gard about the lighthouses and the history because it's fascinating. Uh, That's actually sold out now. So moving on to the Saturday after that, we'll start with having workshops uh, in Castletown. Um, I'm running, um, we're going to light the castle. We'll have um, light installations around Castletown. And then the following weekend, we're moving up to the Murick Park where we'll have a light, huge light installation in the park and we're going to light the lake and have lots of activities and things going on there. You're going well. to light the lake? We're lighting the lake. <gasps> How are you going to do that? It sounds fascinating. Oh, you'll have to wait and find out. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to keep some things a surprise. <laughs> so that's all to come and obviously you can find out about that online. Just to yeah. let people know though, if they are looking for you online, there's been a few changes, haven't there, to your social media handles and things because of course it's not 2018 anymore. That's right. So where can they find you now? Yeah. So our website remain, remains the same. It's our island. I am and we've just picked that up and translated it over to um, all our social media sites so instead of 2018 year of our island you'll just find us with our island I am so that's um, our Facebook and Twitter and Instagram and obviously one of the things about um, this initiative is, is I suppose the sort of legacy element of it really Jenny isn't mm. it yeah absolutely um, we we knew that um, a key part of of the the program being a success would be that we left some things behind and that there were whether it was resources or continuing events or or projects um, that have created new activities or interests that we've done something not just in one year but we've done something that will remain beyond that and we're, we really are in the point now of talking about and beginning to launch all of those different sort of legacy projects as we've kind of talked about. And there's a video which people can see, which sort of wraps up the highlights of the year. Is that right? Yeah. So on our island.im website, we have a video um, that we've put together that really uh, is a quick run through of the 12 months. So it takes us through each of the themed months and has a quick um, look at all of the different things that we've done, the different events that either we partnered with people with, we put on ourselves or we funded for others to put on. Um, and, and that might have been an event or an activity or a project coming through to fruition. And we've kind of tried to just showcase all of those. And you, you talk about funding. I mean, we can't avoid the fact that obviously it has been in the news recently with Tinwood questions being asked about it. Yeah, um, we we have had a number of Tim Will Dan Keys questions to answer lately. Um, what we are also doing is putting together an evaluation report because actually there are lots of things um, that we really want to shout about. Um, you sort of said before, what you know, was there something in particular that we could spend some time talking about? I literally could spend the next three hours telling you about all the stuff we achieved, all the great stories that we've heard, and all the things that we're still trying to cram into the next eight weeks or six mm-hmm. weeks that's left of the of the program. Um, so. Yeah, I think uh, I think there's plenty to be shouting about and that video is a really lovely demonstration of them all in about 13, 18 minutes, something like yeah. that. So, yeah. So, Anna, when it does come to a close, you're saying before you just you go back to your day jobs as such, what will you then be doing? Well, Jenny and I work in, uh, in the Cabinet Office in Change and Reform, so we deal with lots of varying projects um, that come our way that affect change throughout the whole organisation. So we get... Well, we get involved in all sorts, don't we? Really interesting um, projects, which, which means that we get to work with people from right across government, which we both really enjoy mm. doing. And I guess that's why Year of Our Island came to us, really, was because within the Cabinet Office, we tend to be able to uh, sort of be that, that group of people that can bring everybody together. And uh, the, the Year of Our Island programme has been an absolutely prime example of cross-government working, mm. where... You know, almost two years ago now, we sat in a room in the summer and said, we're going to celebrate our island, what we're going to celebrate. And we had education there and the Arts Council and the Sports Council and DEFA and Fisheries and you name it. We had everybody from across government, um, partners, third sector. And yeah, since then, we've kind of come together and worked in a way where everybody's been able to showcase a little bit about what they feel special about the Isle of Man and uh, 
yeah, like I say, we hope through some of the legacy work that that's going to carry on for people. So there will be uh, these various events uh, celebrating the illuminating aspects of the Isle of Man. So if you go to the uh, Our Island page, you'll be able to find out much more about that. And of course, we will put the details on the blog after the programme.